but they didn't seem to be. Like I said earlier, you're holding up. So do you have a message for other people? Because usually, you know, sometimes when something like this happens, you're angry immediately. You're you're upset. You you're aggressive. But you're kind of just taking it as it comes. Yes, I'm in I'm in shock, and and I'm hurt, but I'm I am not. Right now, I'm not angry at anybody. I just want God to take care of everybody and everybody's family. There's their family and, and watch over all of us and, and everybody learn something from it. But she was a beautiful person and a lot of people loved her. Thank you, Shelly. Um, yeah. Wonderful living. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you. Hi, good morning. Good morning. I'm in North Carolina, South Carolina. We're kind of late, but um, your, your name is Shirley. I picked that up. Yes, Shirley. What's your relation to? She's my daughter. Wow. And so you live here together with, with yes, your mother she, as well. She had in my grand my they didn't have you didn't have it in paper, but my dad lives here too. He's in bed. He's set up to about three or four, but yes, we we all lived here because when the film industry. Um, lost its incentives in Wilmington. She was extras casting director. She decided to come here and, and help with mom and dad. My dad's fighting cancer. My mom's memory is, is not good. And she's decided to help here, but she would, she would travel a lot. She would go. She, she liked uh, Harry Potter and, and she had met Tom Fel Felton and she had went to Europe and he, where he sings. So she had, was planning to go July 5th and I had gone to the beach Tuesday and got back late, oh, Sunday evening. And uh, so she had she had really helped with mom and dad and she had taken them to the doctor. But she said, you know what I really want to do is being an influencer. I want to work toward being an influencer and, and maybe not get back into the film. She hadn't made up her mind whether she wanted to get back in the film industry, but she was wanting to stay here and help with, help with mom and dad right now. This is and, a lot to take in. And, yes, it is. How are you able to remain so composed? I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's the faith in the Lord that I'll see her again soon, sometimes in the future or soon. You know, maybe we'll get to, get to see her again. And uh, I think that's what it is. I think I'm a calm person anyway, laid back person. But I think it's the faith that helps a whole lot and we have so many friends praying and uh, my uncle my uncle Marvin Lee was here last night and his pastor and um, and they've been praying for him and my cousin Beverly had a pray prayer prayed for us and spent the night with us other people so I think that I think that is helping but it was such a shock to be watching TV here like an earthquake and then all of a sudden call down there call down the stairs and see everything that was going on and knowing yeah. something bad had happened. To that was gonna, I was going to ask, if you could take me back to when it happened late last night, what did you hear and see? I, I heard like the, the house shook and it, it was like an earthquake and it shook and it was a loud noise and I knew something had hit, and hit the house. So I walked over, I went in, in there with the stairs and looked down and it was like uh, debris and smoke coming up and uh, not on fire but just from dust well it was really dust and and I called her and her name and I went and got I went um, my mom had gotten up and she went down the stairs and then people started coming in right away because the highway patrol was chasing them and so people were here on the scene quickly and uh, they got my mom to come back up the stairs which I was trying to do and, and the driver had gotten out and ran. Yeah, the driver had gotten out and ran, and the other one was on the ground where they had apprehended him. And they called out the other one's name, and later they, they got him, they found him. I was actually speaking with her cousin, Eric, um, he, this morning. Yes. He was talking about how she's vibrant, life of the party. Yes, yes, she was. She mm -hmm. was. She was a, um, just a very fun person and just... Just yeah, humorous had a great sense of humor and just loved loved people, and she would make um, it's kind of a humor. Um, it was kind of a humor where she would make a remark, uh, like you know, a little bit cynical or something. Sometimes we're teasing, but she had a great sense of humor and was lots of fun. Do you know if she was it an immediate? 
I think she was asleep. I'm believing she was asleep, uh, and that's what the coroner thought. And so it, it happened so quick. No screams or so anything. It, it happened fast. It is reassuring. And what do you have to say? We all know that she posted on Facebook moments before it happened. What, what do you have to say about that? I'm so glad she did that. It's a beautiful picture of her. And her friend Stephanie pointed that out. That's it. I think she posted just a few minutes before it happened. So and I looked and she did. She had a lot going for her. Yes, yeah, she did. She did. Her, her, um, she had an online clothing business and, uh, and then and then uh, her traveling and uh, different interests and perhaps she would she was thinking about getting back in the film in industry but she was really wanting to do more traveling a lot of traveling she an only child yes she is okay. she was born in 1980 in texas oh, right and joy yes yeah, she was she she is she i love her oh i hope you learn i hope you learn not to to use um, thoughtlessly drive fast and perhaps under the influence and think about other people's lives and your own and um, think, really think and learn a lesson from it. Now, is, is that a, a lot to clean up down there? It looks like. Yes, yes. The fence, that's a long way to, it's this, a lot. to travel. It's a lot to take in. It um, is, it is. It's unbelievable that it, that one came up and hit it. <laughs> hit the house like that and went all the way in. How long had she been living here? I see, we have been back over, um, let's see, it's it's probably been about uh, three years now. Okay, gotcha. She, she was getting ready to do some new things and she wanted to help with mom and dad mm -hmm. or she would have been in Florida or somewhere or back to Wilmington or something, but but she did get to travel and she loved that. And her her, be, her one of her best friends, who's a doctor's physician's assistant, they were gonna go, they were gonna go to something, I think back in, uh, uh, it might've been in Canada, or, I can't remember, but it was something to do with their interest in Harry Potter. Mm -hmm. They were gonna do something together. They're really close friends. Is there anything else you'd mm. like to add? No, but, um, Appreciate I appreciate prayers, and I know God will help us through all through all of this. But my dad is almost ninety; he'll be ninety in July, mm -hmm. and uh, so just appreciate all the love and prayers. And she was a she had a great a great um, gift of of uh, love for other people and fun, mm -hmm. and I always always remember that. And uh, if you don't mind, just saying your first and last name. Shirley so Niemeyer. Can you spell that for me? Uh, S-H-I-R-L-E-Y oh. Niemeyer, N-E-I-M-E-Y-E-R. And her dad and her aunt, different relatives are in, in uh, New Brownsville, Texas, and they're going to be coming out here. And so so we're going to pray, keep praying for, for everybody and from the, the Lord of blessing and help us all through it. And you guys were already asleep when it happened, right? I wasn't. I oh. was watching TV. I had been sleeping off and on, tired from being gone about uh, six days to Myrtle Beach. The got in late the night four, and she'd been sick, and I went and got medicine for allergies and allergies and asthma, and got cold and flu, Alka Seltzer for, mm -hmm. and uh, so I was up kind of late. So I was just sleep uh, sleeping off and on because I didn't sleep a whole lot on my vacation. <laughs> Okay. The, so I was still awake watching TV. I'd slept earlier in the day. Gotcha. Yeah, okay. I think I asked everything I could think of, but we appreciate you chatting appreciate with us. Um, really appreciate it. Could you, appreciate y'all. Yeah.